YouTube, what it do? So yesterday I ordered some McDonald's on DoorDash and that shit was disgusting, bro. Burgers was flavorless, fries was soggy, and then the McFlurry was runny and watery. I'm like, yo, what y'all doing? So today I'm finna go to the store and buy all this shit I need so I can make McDonald's at home. Nigga, let's go. Disrespect the five, I put your ass in full chain. Come on, my phone, she said Miss Jackson going through her brain. Yes, sir. Cop the grub. Everything I need for the burgers and everything I need for the Oreo McFlurry cost me like $26. So, honestly, we finna go crazy. Oh shit. Like the video right now, bro. Push a real nigga up on the algorithm. We are 100 subscribers away from 2K. We ballin'. Pull up. Go ahead and hit the Zostick, my friend. You know what I'm saying? Get them love taps in one time for no bees. You, you straight. Me, you already know that's the one turn. You feel me? Go ahead and spin back again. Take another hit. You feel me? Puff, puff, pass on the channel all day. You feel me? You straight, homie? Yes, sir. I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. Video by video, we are proving to the world that it's better to cook at home than going out and just eating some fucking bullshit, bro. Then you eat it all, and then you still kind of hungry. I mean, that's if you a gluttony ass motherfucker. But still, you don't even feel satisfied all the way, bro. And then the food don't even be all that good quality to be spending all that much money on in the first place. But with this meal that we finna cook at home, man, this shit finna be scrumptious. Might even have food left over for tomorrow more money for your buck or more buck for your bank or how where the fuck the old coat go oh yeah we switched up the rap i forgot to show y'all i usually be smoking grabba but when i walked in the smoke shop today asking for the grabba they ain't have it and old boy was like hey man you gotta be put on that duckies bro this is way better than grabba and i was like man I'm gonna take your word for it. It's way bigger than a grabba, but it's honestly not too bad. I fuck with it. I tried to hold it. I tried to look cool. I can't even cap and I paid the price for it. I'm gonna take one last hit y'all and I'm good. God. Yes, sir. We in a bitty with it. Y'all already see that plump thick to patty with that lettuce too. Let's go ahead and chop it up. Ooh, wee baby. You seeing that chopped lettuce? You seeing that chopped tomatoes? Yes, yeah, sir. Time to lay that bacon down. Let's get it. All right, y'all, so the goal is to make this better than McDonald's. So we gonna make some candy bacon. Let's get this seasoning going for the bacon. Let's start with some black pepper. Then we gonna add some cayenne. And last but not least, baby, that brown sugar. Oh, damn, I poured way too much. Hold on, hold on. Yes, sir, y'all seeing that beautiful blend? Sitting here looking like some oatmeal grounds, looking like some fine cat litter. I'm just gonna look fire on that bacon, though. Let's add it. Now we're just gonna flip it over and season the opposite side. Ooh, yes, sir, y'all seeing it? That sweet season of bacon. Let's go ahead and add it in. We're gonna set it to 400. And we gonna let it cook while it's preheating. Let it do its thing. Yes, yeah, sir, it's time to make these ground beef balls. Balls. Just grab a good old chunk and you just rub it into a ball like that. All right, y'all, time to season this meat. Let's add some seasoning salt, that garlic powder, onion powder, black pepper, and last, that smoked paprika. Yeah, just rub your balls just nice in there like that. Pause. Oh yeah, look, 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 y'all. That bacon ready. That bacon is sizzling nice and juicy, nice and seasoned. We good to go. All 
All right, y'all, time to get this McFlurry going. Only three ingredients, just some ice cream with some Oreos and some milk. That just goes to show you how lazy McDonald's is. But let's go ahead and add it in. Bruh. Y'all can see it's all milky and run down. Let's go ahead and add some more ice cream. Hey, I see we got a McFlurry cut with it. I'm mad as hell, bro. They gave me the little weak ass McDonald fake ass McFlurry straw spoon, bro. You feel me? They didn't give me the real McFlurry spoon, but fuck it, we gonna roll with it. I went ahead and tried my best at crushing up some Oreos. Let's go ahead and add it on top. Yeah, buddy. I'm gonna sit this in the fridge and we gonna let it chill and get even more colder. Let's go ahead and whip up this special sauce real quick. We gonna start with some jalapeno tomato ketchup. Already know gotta throw that mustard in there too. And last, a dash of that real mayo. And last, I'm gonna throw some slap your mama in there. Just a little bit, just a little bit, get though. Yes sir, let's get these burgers going. Let's add a little bit of oil. I put butter on this bread, y'all. And for this bun, I'm gonna put some mayonnaise on. Yes, sir, y'all seeing us set up with it. We got that bottom bun. Let's spread that special sauce. Now we add them patties on. Already know time to throw in that lettuce. Put that tomato on. I was gonna put on two, but I was like, fuck it, man. We gonna put on one. Throw on a dash of salt and a dash of pepper. Just a little, just a little. And last, since the goal is to make it better, I'ma sprinkle some queso blanco on top. Go ahead and place that bad boy on top, just like that. Ooh, y'all seeing a good look at that burger? Y'all already know this is the Daily W, you feel me? Let's go ahead and wrap it up. Yeah, man. I don't even work at McDonald's and I just wrapped the hell out that whole hell yeah. I already know, gotta add a special sauce. I already know, gotta slide double patties on bun. And last, you seeing that beautiful glaze, syrupy bacon, yo. Go ahead and put that bad boy all on top. That sticky icky. And for top bun, we gonna stick to the traditional fire sauce. Yes, sir, wrap that bad boy up. I'm just too fire when he got that double D, double thick BBL right here. God damn. God damn, y'all seeing it, man. I don't even know which one I should pick. Like, see? I might eat both at the same time type shit. Fuck it, let's go with a bacon McDouble. This is like my favorite at McDonald's, so I'm like, fuck it, we might as well go with this one. First bite, and I already know it's better than McDonald's. Second bite makes you want to put McDonald's out of business. The meat cooked just right, oh my God. The bacon is sweet and spicy at the same time. And the special sauce, perfection. Man, let's get into the Daily Double. Big ass burger right here. How is this better than the first burger, bro? The first burger, bang. But this one is even better. Like, God damn, how I do it even better, bro? God damn. Mm, that queso cheese on top, it blends in so good with the tomato and the lettuce. So it's like eating a taco on top of a burger, bro. Jesus Christ. The burger is the same, nice and flavorful. Cooked just right. Cheese nice and melted all up in there. The seasoned tomato, oh my God. Y'all see, that's the Oreo McFlurry, man. Dark ass Oreo McFlurry. Dark ass Oreo McFlurry. I'ma be real, this bitch hit, but at the same time, 
if you ain't really a big fan of sugar like I am, this ain't for you. Because the birthday cake Oreos, that shit was sweet as hell. And it's pretty darn milky. It's still hip. Overall, do I have to fucking say it, bro? Obviously, I beat McDonald's, bro. Bacon McDouble, that bitch is going to get a solid nine out of ten, bro. Daily Double, motherfucker going to get a ten out of ten. In, bro, beautiful McDonald's. Y'all niggas just gotta step up, bro. I don't know what to tell you.